to make this session where uh, to wrap up this session quickly I already installed uh, the Health Igniter for latest version on my server's root directory. I'm using WAMP server, you can see that I'm using WAMP server uh, 64 bit and inside the www directory of my WAMP server I created a folder CI for login and I extracted all these files over here. These are the uh, new files, there is nothing else inside the installation. For this, we can simply check this localhost CI4 login. See, you can see that it is no more than anything. This is simply a coordinator for installation. You can see that. Anyways. Okay, now how to continue? I already get rid of public folder. You can go run it like this. So the public folder is no longer here. And we are going to create controls and then uh, models and reviews directly in the installation directory. And now we are going to open this inside code. Visual Studio code. Taking a bit time like this, it will look cool. Okay, now all our files are in Visual Studio Code. You can see I have the app folder, configurations, and everything is fresh. When we go to the app.php file, and okay. Let's zoom it here. Let's set the this path of our app. CA for login. This is the base path of our app. Let's get rid of index.php2. To remove this index.php file from the URL. Okay, why do we need this? Because I don't like index.php uh, to, to be appear in URL while we access things from the browser. I'll show you an example here. Okay. Let's see the controller first. Here. When we go to the controllers, we have a single home controller, and there is one method. In the home controller it is index. And it it loads welcome message view, which is just generating the word output. Okay, now if go here and simply type, this is the welcome message and this is the welcome message view. Okay, actually this is a large file where I'm showing you a portion of my screen. And we can access it like this. Um, see, the result is same. So I don't like this index.php file from here, so uh, let's quickly remove it. To remove it quickly, I simply have to 
go to this app.php and then I'll remove this. Make sure you have a rewrite module Apache rewrite module enabled in your web server. Otherwise, this thing won't work because this thing uses the htaccess file. The htaccess file. Where is the htaccess? This is the htaccess file. And it uses this. And now we have to change one more thing here. This is rewrite base. We have to uncomment this. And we have to provide our folder name. Say we have folder name CI for login uh, uh, inside our server server's root folder. And inside www we give the name CI for login. Okay. See here. www CI for login. This is our app folder actually. Where all the files related to this app resides and reside actually not resides. Anyways, okay. Now we are done with the configuration. We get rid of this thing and now we can try running it without this. See, it is working. Same. Now you can try it in view. It is working fine. Yes. Okay. 